Hey guys, Jay Stussy here, and I'm here with a brand new 60 inch Slick 580 from Extreme Flight and 3D Hobby Shop. Now today I'm going to show you how to restore the Airboss ESC with the factory default setting. So we get the airframe and the power combo with the torque motor and Airboss ESC. The ESC throttle response is usually pretty slow. Now when we reset it, the throttle response is a lot quicker. And personally, I like it a lot better for, like that for 3D, uh, any downhill 3D where you need to have a quicker throttle response for recovery. Now re resetting this will ensure this, and uh, we start off by taking the prop off because we have to start at full throttle in order to enter the setup mode for the ESC. And uh, we already got the uh, battery in the airplane here, and uh, we're about ready to plug it in and about ready to uh, go set it up. In order to enter the setup mode for the Airboss ESC, we need to start with the throttle stick, full throttle, as you can see here on the radio. Now we already have the EC5 battery connectors plugged in, and with the switch, we can turn it on and off even with the connector pl still plugged in. So with the throttle, full throttle, I'm gonna go ahead and flip the switch on, and you should hear it go into arm and go into setup mode. Now we are in setup mode in the ESC, and what we can do is we can follow along with the beeps here. Restore factory default. And shot the throttle. And now the and then you can hear it count the cells and it's armed and we are now in the factory default setting of the Airboss ESC.